when I first saw Bella, I didn't think she was going to make it. Her left paw was completely crushed and was just covered in mange. I just never seen a sadder looking kitten in my entire life. We ended up picking her up and taking her to the vet. She would just lay there and she would be really timid. It just literally felt like she was void of personality. She was void of hope. Her spirit was completely crushed. Her actions were very robotic versus being cat-like almost. She was always scared. She would lay in a little ball and just kind of look around with this massive amount of fear in her eyes. That sensation didn't really leave until she came to my house. When we left there, it was with the knowledge that she was going to have to have her paw amputated. I was terrified. The first day that she came to my house, I got her like a little house where she could hide because I knew that that was going to be her first instinct. Go back in your little hole. The first time that I gave her food at home, that's when I kind of started realizing, oh my God, she's actually a kitten. Her personality from the vet's office to when she got home almost made it feel like she realized that she actually had a shot at a normal life. And then out of nowhere, she would start rolling around in her little bed and like showing me her belly or giving me her messed up paw, which to me gave a lot of sign of trust. I'm like, now she's living the life. The minute I saw her actually start to play a little bit, there was a realization like she's gonna be okay. She really allowed herself to be a kitten. She had spent so much time just surviving that being a kitten was never an option. We went to the doctor on her three week checkup and he said, I think we can save her leg. So within a week of getting her back, she was actually playing with the leg. You guys, she's finally playing with her paw. The first time I actually saw her take a ball and hit the ball with her leg, even with these pins and this cast on, I was like, oh my God, Bella, we stand a chance. She's just been improving every single day since. I think there was a part of Bella that always knew something was missing within her. The minute that she realized that that leg was there, that little cat became so confident. It was like a switch. All of a sudden she's like, I'm okay. She's just such a delightful, happy, funny, spunky little girl. She was a butterfly that out of nowhere went into the cocoon and awakened. See how far you've come, Bella.